Hey guys, welcome back to the Native Family. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. I just want to let you guys know, for those of you that have been leaving comments on our videos, I'm going to get caught up. Um, we went through something as a family. Kind of scary. We will do an update video pretty soon to let you guys know what's going on. But everything is okay now, thank goodness. But I went to the Dollar Tree because the girls are really in the Christmas spirit this year. Um, we've already gotten some of our decorations up. I'm working on the tree, but we do have a new kitten this year. And she thinks we brought the tree in just for her to play in. So needless to say, I haven't been able to finish the tree yet. But I did go and pick up some new decorations. Um, we have quite a few holiday decorations, but it's so hard not to buy the cute new things that you see. So the kids want to make it as festive as we possibly can because we will not be able to travel for the holidays this year. So we found these door covers and they're really cute. So we picked, we have three doors inside the house that um, is visible to everybody. So... The girls picked this one up for their restroom. It's the cute little penguins. And they're 30 by 60 inches, so they're pretty good size, you know. And then this one says, Believe in the Magic of Christmas. They wanted that one for their bedroom door. And then for our bedroom door, they put, the girls picked these out. This one, it says, It's the season to be jolly. Or tis the season to be jolly. But I thought that was fun, just a little door covers for them to, you know, decorate with. I did need some glue sticks, and they didn't have the smaller glue sticks. They had these giant ones, so I guess I won't have to reload my glue stick very often because these are long. And uh, I could probably cut them in half, too, with a X-Acto knife. So we are going to be finishing off um, a Christmas wreath that I'm working on. These were different. These are the LA Colors Dashing. I'm assuming these are for the holiday, but they're really pretty tips with just the little gold. They're very similar to what I have on my nails now. But I picked up two of those because Rhiannon is having fun with doing different press-on tips and things like that. They have these super cute, sweet Christmas marshmallows. And me and the girls are going to be making um, hot chocolate bombs. So we thought this would be cute to put inside of the bomb itself. It says you get three different shapes. So that's going to be fun. We only picked up one bag because that's a lot of um, marshmallows, actually. Always pick the kids up the seasonal socks. I only picked up two pair of the Christmas socks this time, though, but Nena got the little gingerbread. It, look, it even has a gingerbread, what is that, reindeer. So cute, little gingerbread house. And then Rhiannon is on a cat kick right now. So this one has the cats inside the stockings. Look, it has the tail. with the, It's really cute. Another pair of Snugadoo socks because my oldest absolutely loves fluffy socks when she's home. So those are for her. And then I found these ones for myself. They're not holiday at all, but I absolutely love French Bulldogs. And eventually I'm going to own one, guys. I'm telling you, I'm working on it. But it's really cute. I'm not I think it says I'm all. I'm not sure what it says. I'm all. Uh, I don't want to open them yet. Anyways, they're super cute. And they're a nice little pink, light pink uh, heel and toe. And then the gray ones are just gray with uh, light pink polka dots. So two pack of socks just to kick around the house and can't beat that. Um, these guys were super cute. Now, I'm going to change it up a little bit. I don't like the pink nose, so his nose will be painted red. And if you look really closely, these are the best ones that I could find. This one is actually missing the holly off of it. So I'm going to go through all my Christmas things and find some little other, um, like floral things to put here on his hat. And the same thing with the snowman. See how they have this big glop of glue? But I like the fact that it's a sled. It's super cute. I'm going to have fun. I have a new tiered tray I'm going to be working on, so these guys will look really cute like that. I didn't pick up a lot of ornaments because as far as like Christmas tree ornaments, guys, I am set. Wait till you see the walkthrough. We will be doing a walkthrough too. Rhiannon wants to do like an ugly sweater type thing for work, and she saw these and wanted me to make them into earrings. Now, they're not heavy at all. These are super light, actually, so these will be fun little earrings to make for her. So I'm just going to take these off and then take the earring hooks and hook those up for her so she'll have those for her ugly sweater that she wants to do for work i did pick up some more signage um going through my decorations i realized i don't have a lot of wall decor and i wanted to change up in the kitchen a little bit this year and this one is as it's the most wonderful time of the year with the reindeer and it's absolutely beautiful I, I was going to get the Santa Claus one i think that matches was it santa or a snowman i'm not sure but i only picked up this one but that was the prettiest one. And then the other sign I picked up, I think they had these tags last year too. I just didn't pick them up at the time. But I love St. Nick when he looks like with his little red cheeks and stuff. He just looks very happy. And that one says joy again. It goes with all of my buffalo check. 
So those will be in the kitchen. And then this one is really pretty. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this one yet, but it is the, like the 3D type sign. The jingle all the way is in metal. When you guys are going through the store, make sure you pay attention to these because some of these were coming off. This was one of the best ones that I could pick up and it's got the faux wood in the back. So really cute for a buck, can't beat it. A uh, quick review, these are gone. Those are the These are the Russell Stover peppermint um, patties. Um, they're gone. Everybody loved them. So if you see them, pick them up. You only get a couple in here. How many do you get in here? Uh, you get about five pieces in here. So everybody got to try one. I wish I would have picked up more because I didn't know that the kids were going to like them that much. Um, like I said before, we are going to be making like uh, hot chocolate bombs and we're going to be making homemade candy. And these were just super cute. They're like the little uh, peppermints and the candy canes. Just a little mold. They also had penguins and things like that, but I think I have the penguin one. I have to go through my candy making stuff. I did pick up this. I'm going to be working on some garland to go around my kitchen window. And this is 15 feet. And then I also picked up the buffalo check ribbon so that I can make a bow for that. I always use these table runners to do a little bit of different accents when I'm putting out the table decor. So I picked it up in white and I picked it up in red, but I'm not really liking the color of the red so we'll have to see but I pick those Rhiannon thought these were really really cute they're, they're just the little houses and she picked up I'll show you in a second a mini tree they're going to be decorating a tree for their room this year like I told you they're going all out this year they weren't going to let me sleep through it at all and then one more ornament that I did pick up he won't be going on the tree I think he would make really cute like centerpiece for a wreath yeah, he looks pretty good. I don't think I'm going to really even change anything. It looks like he has all his holly. But again, with these, pay attention to here because you see how his horns are put on separate. Make sure that you get ones that are still attached. Um, Snow. I'm also going to be painting a mural on my slider doors to try to make it look more Christmassy here because on the coast we really don't get that cold. So just one can of snow to do that. Okay, this cup, I have been on this cup like hunt for this cup for years everybody has picked it up every year my store never had them and if they did everybody bought them all it's just a little snowman guy I probably won't be drinking out of him I was thinking of putting some greenery in here and just making him look like a little chia pet for my coffee bar this was a really pretty nail polish this is the Drew Barrymore line flower and what color is that go with the flower well, it says flower, but really pretty neutral color. We needed more of these because Rhiannon gave her friend one of the masks that they didn't have a mask when they went out. So we need to put that back in the essential bags. Rhiannon just needed a toothbrush. And then she picked up Paul. Paul is the polar bear. Little grow kit. I think it's mint. So she's going to give her a hand at trying to grow a little mint plant with that one. For the hubby, I just picked up some of the foot powder spray. Let's see. Is it compared to anything? It doesn't say it's compared to anything. Anyways, you know what that's for. Okay, toilet paper. Guys, we are in the toilet paper apocalypse 2.0 out here. I'm sure you guys are wherever you're at too. Um, I just picked up one more pack. Um, the Dollar Tree is limiting to four per household. Like I said, I don't try to overstock. I just want to make sure we're covered for the Thanksgiving holiday. So I picked up one. But everywhere else is gone. The Walmart is empty. Everybody's empty. These are always a repurchase. I picked up two more packs of the Ultra Shine. It just works good and my dishwasher doesn't leave like residue or anything. Rihanna needed some more of the canvases. So we picked up two more of those for Christmas gifts. She likes to paint for people. One lever uh, 2000 body wash. This is a good deal. It's 11 and a half ounces. I was just in Walmart and these are like three, four bucks. Can't beat it. And then I finally found the Dermasol Moisturizing Body Wash and the Cool Melon. This smells absolutely amazing. So I did pick up two of those. There wasn't a lot on the shelf. That's why I didn't really, you know, stock up, stock up on the body washes. And then, of course, the little trees are out. If you guys didn't know, I never seen them before. We didn't pick it up, but they have the green one, the white one, and they have an iridescent white one now. Really pretty, but the girls are going for more of a Harry Potter theme miniature tree so they're doing all the golds and the reds but it's out there i should have took a picture for you guys but i didn't but that is my dollar tree haul nothing big and spectacular we're just getting ready to decorate for the season i hope you guys all have a happy thanksgiving um i will be back with an update video and i got a couple more review videos coming up for you guys so if you guys can do me a favor and like this video 
um, hit your notification bell to be notified of when we upload new videos. And as always, family, don't forget to be kind, inspired, be inspired, and I will see you shortly with another video.